All right, it is time for an Airbnb house tour uh, for our Tokyo Airbnb. Let's go. Storage with the entryway. You have to take off your shoes when you come in. And then you have a pair of slippers to start. Uh, the first door here is the bedroom. Very cute. Liz and I are staying in here. And then there's a hallway. A little closet. Off the hallway is the bathroom with the toilet and the tub in separate places. And then we go in this door. And there's Liz. <laughs> uh, with our little kitchenette. Super cute. Nice, not really nice view, but. It's a great view of the subway. <laughs> um, and then the little living room with our extra beds and a Chelsea. Oh, yeah. Um, so Chelsea's bed also folds up into a couch like this. So if we had another person, we'd be good. And then there's this awesome little middle closet that both rooms go into. And so we are using it as our uh, mini hidden doorway between the bedroom and the living room. And you know, since we have a lot of stuff, it is very important. So a super cute little Airbnb, very close to a subway, and yeah, good stuff. There's a rock on the bed. We're not sure why. It appeared mysteriously and nobody put it there. So, hmm. Japan trip day three. We had a slow morning, slept in a little bit to recover, and then we headed out for Sunsoji Temple, and we looked at a bunch of the shops along the way, and got to see the temple, see some of the Buddhas and shrines. Uh, and now we're heading over to the uh, Edo Museum to meet up with my friend uh, who is from Japan and will hopefully be able to give us some insider secrets uh, as well as getting some good history in instead of shopping today. Liz will like that. So we'll see how it goes.
rice porridge, cold soba, hot soba, udon, it's udon. Udon. udon, I know my noodles, and you got hot soba, I got hot soba, yes. Uh, Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy my Japan adventure series. If you like to see this type of content, please like and subscribe. Thank you.